Good morning everyone, this is Simon from MotionVFX.com. Today we'll talk about M Lowers, which is a collection of 50 professional lower thirds for Final Cut Pro 10 and Motion 5. This is our new collection of lower thirds and they come with a bundle or separately. So we've got 10 packs of um, lower thirds and each pack contains 5 lower thirds. When you are looking on our website, you can see that you can click on the M lowers here and to see full bundle, which is the um, promo video for the M lowers. And down below, you can click on the category to see each each pack's content. So, for example, I like the elegant style uh, content. I just click it, and I can see all uh, M lowers included in the elegant pack. Now we can browse all. 10 categories and you can of course add them separately to your cart but you can of course uh, buy the bundle the M, M lowers bundle which is quite amazing because uh, each lower third when purchasing with the bundle um, it gives you something like three dollars per uh, lower third so this is pretty pretty nice deal so after purchasing M lowers you get the download link with your packs if you have purchased the M lowers bundle then you get 10 downloads and to download download them just click download and wait for the downloading once the download is finished you have a zip files which you have to unpack and then you have the installation files you have 10 installation files which you have to install separately so i just double click on my M lowers uh, cartoon pack and just click continue to install it just click continue agree for a license and click install Put your password and you are done. That's it. So once installed, you can open Final Cut Pro 10. So I'm in Final Cut Pro 10 and M Lowers also works with Motion 5, but we'll focus on Final Cut Pro 10 right now. And to access M Lowers, all you have to do is go to your titles here. And then down below you have the M Lowers group up here. And you can see I have installed the all packs like a Cartoon Pack, Elegant Pack, Grunge, Life, Modern, Music, News, Retro, Sport and Wedding Pack. Now to preview them, of course, you have to, uh, you, can, you can mouse over them to see the preview of the uh, lower third, like this one, or, or this one, or this fantastic monster here. This is Cartoon Pack. I can go to, for example, Grunge Pack and preview it as well. Let's try another one. Okay. Now let's go to Music, for example. All right, that's pretty nice. So, for example, I want to work with the Grunge Pack. I just drag my lower third here and just drop it on my timeline like that. And you can see that it works real time and I have my beautiful lower third on my footage. Now, of course, I have to customize it. And first thing you will notice that my lower third is too long to my video. So I can simply drag it at the end and just drop it here. So it will fit into my timeline. And you can see that my lower third right now is something like three seconds. I'll just move it a little bit uh, here and you can see that my lower third perfectly fits my timeline right now so to customize it i have to click my lower third here and go to inspector and you can see that i've got my uh, information in there where i can change my text for example i can type my name and i can change my additional information something like motionvfx.com and you can see, I will just turn off my um, inspector and you can see that my lower third behaves pretty nicely and animates perfectly. So I can, of course, access more functions there. We have uh, published plenty of uh, options so you can play with them. We can, of course, change the, the colors of my, of my text to something like that. Subtitle color to something like more reddish. I can of course play with the elements. I can change their color as well. And I can change the color of the background, for example, to something like a crazy, ugly looking um, bluish. <laughs> or uh, I can play with the scale or the position of my uh, elements. So you can see I can move my uh, elements around. So you can customize it and 
um, fit it perfectly to your project. So this is this is Grange Pack. This is one of the lower terms from the Grange Pack. Let's try another one. For example, let's go to some like a modern one. Let's say I like this one, so I just drag it and drop it on my footage up here. I will just turn off my um, inspector to show it to you. And you can see that we have the same situation here. My uh, lower third is a little bit too long to, uh, for my footage. So I just drag it and um, make it shorter. And I can play my video to see my lower third. That's great. So the same situation, I just open, I just click the, um, the lower third and I open my inspector and I can change on my details I have on my screen. So for example, I can play with the, with the colors and uh, make it more ugly. Of course, um, our designers created it. Just a beautiful, just a beautiful colors, just a beautiful uh, design. And you will, you'll be amazed with the uh, possibilities of the customization of that uh, lower thirds. So I can, for example, um, put my uh, different hour or change my text here to something like um, I like <laughs> and stuff like that. So you can play with them and you can see that there's a lot of options with the lower uh, thirds with the custom customization of them. So I'll turn off my um, inspector again and this is my lower third up here. Beautiful. Okay, let's try a few more. So we've got the, for example, the music one and I'll just drop it up here. Same situation, I have to just move it a little bit down and I have beautiful lower third with the guitar on my footage. Just great. Okay, and let's try something else, something like uh, maybe retro pack. So let's try this crazy car up here. We have a red car moving into our screen and this is the retro lower third. Beautiful. And of course, we can click on the um, lower third, access the inspector, change our text and play with the options. So that's, uh, that's a great option um, to play with. So this is M lowers. We have 10 packs of M lowers. Each pack is $39, contains five lower thirds. If you want to save, just buy a bundle, which is $149. This is really great deal, guys. So go ahead and play with it. Now let's go to Motion 5. So I'm in Motion 5 right now and to access some lowers from Motion 5 you have to um, choose your file and select new. This window will come up and you will find your M lowers down below on the list. From in the Final Cut titles, there is an M lowers group, so just click it and you will see that there is a collection of M lowers here. So I have all M lowers in my on my list. So let's choose one of them. For example, I will choose the let's try the elegant one, the elegant 03. I just click open and my motion project opens and I can play with all elements here. I have the animation which I can change. I can I can change the elements, I can customize it. And of course you can access your your published elements after clicking the project here then inspector and then project up here and you have publishing elements where you can change your um, your your description, your text, etc. And the lower thirds comes with the alpha channel. So if you're working for example with Adobe Premiere you can use um, them with the Adobe Premiere, just export them with your alpha channel and you can see that we have the color channel here and we have the transparency um, color um, transparency channel up here and you can see that it works perfectly so if you want to use it with your um, with your Adobe Premiere just um, click share it and choose export movie and make sure that you're exporting with the alpha channel so make sure that your um, video is the is selected to color plus alpha so make sure that your and uh, the quick time you're exporting to um, supports uh, alpha channel. So the best option is um, QuickTime Pro, ProRes 4x4 and uh, I think it, that, that works perfectly with the alpha channel so you'll have no problems with that. So you can of course access your options here and you can dig into elements and uh, play with the uh, with the elements like um, flower you can just uh, you know move it around and create another animation of it or go inside and dig the elements and play with them and see how the project uh, works and looks. 
So this is M lowers in motion five. So these are M lowers for Final Cut Pro 10 and Motion 5. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. I'm Simon from MotionVFX.com. Thank you for watching.